Hello everyone and welcome to Breath Edge, an indie game in early access on Steam which is a sort of humorous take on space adventures as you can see by the warning indicating that we should expect some off-color humor. I would describe it as raunchy, though not overbearing in my short time with the game. The video you're about to see was recorded during a live stream after my Kerbal Space Program stream and it was my first taste of the game. Basically, you play a cosmonaut who works for a space funeral service who got stranded in space after the fleet he works in meets with disaster. I occasionally pronounce the title of the game Breathe Edge uh, during the stream because I initially parsed the name wrong, but I'm pretty sure it's supposed to be Breath Edge. So anyway, here we go. KSV2. No, this is glorious Soviet space program simulator. That sounds about right. Okay, so shall we go with, uh, we have a choice. We can either have English voice or Russian voice. Okay, Russian. All right. Okay, I think, yeah, okay. Back, back. All right, let's see what this is all about and how, how, uh, how offensive it is. I don't know. Standard, the best game mode is a moderate one. Story, emphasis on storyline, infinite parameters, impossible permadeath, no hints, no point wasting your time with this one. Free, no restrictions or deaths, everything is available. Let's just go with standard. Play. Sleeping in bed will restore health. We couldn't have created anything more trite. Okay, maybe it's better in Russian. <laughs> oh, come on. From no. Oh, they've got this kind of humor. Uh, I'd believe it about the font, by the way. We don't we don't need KSP two jokes with this. The Red Ruin Softworks uh, team is categorically against smoking, which causes loud headlines in newspaper and other diseases. And therefore, we suggest you replace this dangerous cigarette in the. Um, I think we censor it, darn it. Or do we let him smoke? I don't know if this is like a censorship setting for the rest of the game. Hmm. This is very meta. Let him smoke. Okay. Letting robot smoke is very dangerous. Time to think of how to behave during the R2D3. <laughs> oh, I I don't think I want. See, it puts him in a bad mood. Put on a spit. I spit. I spit on him. Oh, what? Windshield wipers? Oh, right. I've got a visor on. Spitting it doesn't really help. Tell us that you fly to the funeral, but I don't understand anything. Spitting was a lousy idea. We agree. You better tell your story first. Tell him. Fine. Okay. Well, apparently that's later on, and now we're all in the flashback, maybe? Oh, chip. Interstellar Liner Unnamed. Come on. It should be untitled or something like that. Should, uh, that would be really Kerbal. Untitled Craft. <sighs> Green Universe Broccoli Attack? Okay. Ah! 
Iconur, I think we have a problem. This is what happens when you let robots smoke. Could not see the shuttle from space, tell truth, no lie. Okay. Apparently that didn't... I, I don't know what's going on anymore. Definitely unembellished story. Yes, I'm, I'm gonna continue. I firmly oppose... I firmly oppose broccoli, by the way. Loading? Maybe we get to take control of things, finally. The Premier's body? You think so? So far... Yeah. <laughs> we'll see. We'll see how they do. So far they're a little bit all over the place. Chewing gum? Chicken? Your funerary spacesuits built in guide to the world of space funerals. Before we start communicating further, confirm that you're still able to read after impact. Um, how do I say yes? I know. No, broccoli is not like a small tree. Broccoli is like the virus of trees. I didn't even get all those keys, so... Oh! I did, I did not catch all that, but... We're floating. And there's a chicken. Some gas leech leakage detected. Doors are locked. Well, let's plug in that gas leak. Oh, hold it. Oh! I see. Oh, jeez. Um. Oh, but there's a hole, right? Hmm. Ah, the chewing gum, I see. No, the chewing gum! How am I gonna... Okay, tab to... Okay. Can I just plug the rear end of the chicken? I mean... No, not the chicken. Stop it. How do I... Okay, now plug... Yeah, yeah, that. Find the inner phone or get depressed. I think I should be depressed. I, I wish the subtitles were up for a little bit longer. Oh! I've got, like, gravity? I'm walking. I don't have videotapes. Okay. Alcohol! Grandpa's picture. Grandpa it was Grandpa. My last photo is a Grandpa who didn't take part with the, who didn't part with the chicken until his death. He really liked himself here. Okay. Leave it. Can I turn that music down? That that music is a little bit loud.
Why is why why wouldn't there be a chicken in space? It's a pet chicken, very clearly. And if Grandpa liked the chicken, he would bring. The, that's actually too low. Gosh darn it! Non-linear sliders. I mean, why would why would Grandpa abandon the chicken if he liked the chicken? Nice reason. This is very. Focused on the needs of Grandpa, to be honest. Processor. Alcohol. Okay, well, I don't know if I want to process things. Survivor achievement. Equipment, resources, ice. Al alkali. I'm gonna need you guys to, like, pay attention to half the um, subtitles, which I miss, of course. The cheapest swill drunk by all space dogs. Definitely take that. Uh, what waste this stuff is brewed. Could be a propellant. Um, Chiku Belch. Yeah. Expensive, unfiltered, dark, tasteless, non-alcoholic, something chosen by Grandpa solely of its label, although he always denied it and wrinkled his face when choking on it. Um, let's just leave that. Okay. I don't see a whole lot to eat around here, to be honest. Interphone. Check the antenna. Home phone number. Hmm. Okay, antenna. Well, we can rest. Grandpa's all over the place. Crikey. With the antenna. Oh, we're outside. That was quick. I thought I would have to do a little bit more to get outside. Why is my breathe counting to God? That doesn't take that doesn't have a lot of breath. Um The controls for maneuvering around are the same as what you would expect. Okay. I need to find my way back before I die. No, no, up, 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 uh, in, yeah, in, 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 oh god. This is gonna be so tense. 50 seconds worth of... Interphone is broken, what? I just fixed the antenna. Don't forget to feed the chicken. Right. Never asked where that foot. Okay. So like, now what do I do? I still have breath here. Extract plating. Um. Well, there's a little fist thing there. Create a debugging station? Well, anyway. Two-digit password matching algorithm managed to hack the interphone activation codes. Oxygen is not unlimited. No kidding. Ah, uh, uh, no. Did they mean depressurized when they mean depressed? I don't know. Okay, that was not fixing the inner phone. I need to... I guess create a debugging station. Now, how do I create a debugging station? Tools. 
Cryptograph Graphic Debugging Station. Location none. Obtain via craft if possible. Did that guy who was speaking really quickly tell me? Well, there's a drill bl blueprint. Well, maybe we can create a drill. Seems important. Piece of truth. Oh, that's the broccoli attack. More family photos. We could get rid of our spacesuit. I don't want to do that at all. Oh, it's a toilet. Waste disposal system is damaged and operating in reverse mode. The toilet can suck objects flying past the shuttle when the tanks are full? I don't want to know, really. This is like... Oh, this, this is like an inch away from my summer spacecraft. You know what I mean? I need to find a way to... breathe for longer. Well, apparently that... hand and fist... I'm gonna kill myself at this rate, I better... Hmm... Let's get back in quickly and then reassess where I need to go. Oh. Okay, forward. Is this a door I can get through? Because it sure seemed like what I needed to do was over there. Physics in 50 volumes. Um, turn. I can't turn. Oh, I can turn like this. They say the one who reads all 50 volumes will become the person who read all these books. Finished space program? Maybe. Maybe. I don't know, but it's in Russian, so no. But... But it's... You can imagine something close. Hmm... There's not a whole lot of room in here for me to do things. It's pretty clear what I need to do is outside. I'm trying to figure out where I need to be to get at that position. It seems like it's inside the ship after all. Or like... I can't get through this mess. Alright. Worst oxygen tanks ever. Just wanted to say. Can I just... Take a hose and run it like an umbilical. Well, we've got a helmet and an enhanced spacesuit. This is an enhanced spacesuit. We have a drill. Oh, we have a cryptographic debugging station. Oh, no, that's the recipe. All right, right, right. Gosh darn it. I feel like I should drink. Got some notes. Oh, that stuff, yeah. Nothing that I didn't pick up myself. Oh, okay, I guess... Uh, let's see... Babe. There's Babe. Tasks. Create a debugging station. Uh, what a loud headline. I wanted the uh, tutorial comments. Is that what these are? Just the antenna. Um, let me see. Press F to release, relieve yourself, you know. 
um, two digit uh, hack the phone was let's decrypt uh, configured uh, which will take about five years of your current skills try the workstation uh, you mean here this processor or which workstation where was the blueprints anyway I don't see how I craft it. Battery. Hmm. I'm gonna need to eat and drink something soon, too. Which is gonna be a special kind of problem. Food processor. I guess I can color code it, but I don't know. I guess, the, oh, that's the indicator for how to do it, but when I step outside, it looks like I have to be in here. But in here, it doesn't give me a label for what I would need to do. Take rubber. Thick electrical tape. Well, that's good. Universal material, which is used everywhere. Yes. I guess that's basically duct tape. Burdock. Need a scanner. Funny thing is, it has the drill blueprint here, but it doesn't have the other blueprint listed. Well, that's that's duct tape. <laughs> shears. I I didn't even know shears apparently. I don't know. I don't even know how to access the chicken right now. Where do they even put the chicken? Back scratcher. Sure. I, I don't know if you've missed that much. We fixed an antenna, but I don't know how to do the next step, which is to build a cryptographic debugging station. Because the marker that says where I'm supposed to do that tells me I should do that here, which is in the front, which has to be inside the way it is. Oh, it's still got the marker. And oh, it is that thing. Gosh darn it. Why didn't I see that before? So, it is this thing. Now, what am I supposed to do with it? <laughs> Equipment. That's that tools. Get that. Can I do something with it? Double click, right click. Need two metal and one wire. How did you see that? Oh, oh, the red here. 1.8.1? 1. I haven't. Now, how do I get... A oh, break! Break! Need a handy scrapper. Gosh darn it. There's a blob there. Oh! Nutrition package. Well, I think our food's good. Thick green and flows from the nose. Oh dear. Nutritional liquid that somebody choked on. It can be defrosted. There's a blob right there. Blobs are helpful. Um. What? Uh. Oh, that's ice. Oh, excellent water. Let's get some. You know what? Let's get some water first. Survival first, then communication. I don't care about communication that much. Oh, that's an ice ball. Uh, there's a pink thing there. Uh, but I better get back. White object in front of me. Um. Oh yeah. Oh. Uh no, I need a handy scrapper apparently. I'll totally take the ice all day long though. 
something important? I, I need... If there's a handy scrapper floating around, could you make yourself known somewhere? Hmm... Okay, how do I unfreeze things? I want to drink this water. I guess maybe this processor is also a food processor. Nutrition package. Create. And I will create some food. It requires nutritious goo and ice. I really want tanks of air. Okay, so enhanced spacesuit we could create with a roll of fabric, uh, lead paint, and aluminum. I need to figure out how to create a scrapper though. But maybe they can send me that if I get the comms working, right? Maybe that's why I need to get comms working so they can send me more blueprints, hopefully. We need to find metal, wire, it says hands, so there's some metal out there that I can get without a handy scrapper, obviously. And same here. Alright. Somewhere out there. Um, some of this stuff does not require me to... But this probably does require it. Have to break that apart. Need a small bit of metal. That's, that's probably just an ice block. Asteroid, even. Oh, all right. Ah, I missed that. Ah, shucks. Grandpa's mug? Okay, take. <laughs> I don't care. Proto-molecule proto tendrils? Maybe. What are those? Those are probably food. Yep, nutritious goo. I know food when I see it. <laughs> uh, let's see any small bits of... What's this thing? That's another tape thing? Take! Oh, that's fabric. Okay, we'll have to look inside there a little bit more. Biggest catastrophe in the histor history of astronautics. Well... Certainly the biggest as far as I'm concerned. Okay, let's look inside there quickly. Oh, uh, what's this up here? Metal! That's a metal. We need, uh, I think there's another metal here. Okay, we, we're rolling in metal now. Now we need wire. Oh, an actual nutrition package instead of just mystery goo. Okay, let's go back. Oh, no! No! What? Come on, get in, get in, get in! No! No! Get in! Ah! Uh, get in! Why? I can't! Ah! Uh. Jeez. It's not all protein. Just saying. We need wire. Bottle of water, bottle of water. Orps! No, we'll let that be for now. Uh, console. We can't break that. Container. Stupid wire. Uh, 
Can't use a radio. Okay. Well, when you're choking or, or uh, when you're out of breath, you will panic. But it just didn't let me in when I thought I should be able to go in, so that's just wrong. Okay, let's see if I can, can actually drink the water. Use. Okay, good. Very straightforward. And let's use that for food. Need to figure out what to do about the health. They're keeping track of my radiation too. So that's gotta be another thing. Wire. You spot something that looks like wire, tell me. I think we're further away. I don't think that's Earth. I don't know how we get gravity on board this thing either. But since this seems like a rather private vessel that my grandpa and me were in, I think um, we are much more advanced than they would be just orbiting Earth. This was 13 bucks. It's on sale. It was 13 bucks. Um, I mean, I can't extract this plating because it requires shears. I plugged that leak. There's nothing here that can give me wire as far as I can see. Ah, I'm floating around. Okay, let's proceed. Let me proceed in this direction, see if we can get something that is wire. There's a lot of asteroids around and there's sort of like a area that looks like a ring of something. Freezing damage? Oh, okay. Um, let's just go back. Now there's freezing damage. What the heck? The spacecraft definitely looks cozy. I mean, this is like a later sci-fi spacecraft, you know? I mean, this is not... Uh, This is not like your early space spacecraft. Look at the textures. Hmm. It's like it's like a space RV, really. Well, let's go over. That seems a little bit far away, though. I mean, obviously, we need to be close to a scrap if we want some. We're really venturing out here. They aren't joking when they call this Breathe Edge. <laughs> That's pretty obvious. I can't get to that. I don't think there's anything useful there anyway. Oh god, where's my ship? Uh... I've made a horrible mistake. Uh, oh, there. Oh, we're too late. I'm probably gonna die. I probably should have saved at some point. No! Comrade, you are dead. Personal will guard. There's this, as Nachet Nemocho Mirit. Rascazo with Pravda. It is a good point. I was probably lying there. Uh, I don't know where I'm going to be loading from. 